Hello everyone, this is MD Tech here with another tutorial. Today I'll be showing how to fix this alert. In my instance, it happens to be with OneDrive, but every time I'm booting up the computer, I'm getting this alert saying that this particular DLL file is either not designed to run on Windows or it contains an error. Now I've seen this with a couple of different scenarios, but my most reliable way of fixing this is just to replace this DLL file with a clean one or one that is not corrupted. I'll have a link to this web page in the description of this video. Under select language, make sure you select the right language and then left click on this download button. Now it's important you select the correct version of this download. If you're using a 64-bit version of Windows, select this one, the second option. And if you're using a 32-bit version of Windows, select the third option. I'm using a 32-bit, so that's the one I will select. I'm gonna left click on next going to allow that pop-up. Now I'm going to left click on run. We can uh, minimize or close out of our web browser now. We're going to agree to the licensing terms and conditions. Now left click on install. We're going to left click on yes. setup was successful we can close out of this and now if we try and go back into OneDrive we see that it loads successfully without any error messages so I hope this video helped you out guys and I will see you in the next tutorial goodbye